I've been hunting all my life. Ever since I was a uh, little, little boy. My old man and I would go out and we'd hunt deer, elk, turkeys, you name it. My dad never spoke much, so um, those early hunting trips, they, uh, they meant a lot. Started out hunting large game, but as I got older, I began to hunt quicker, more agile animals, smarter. Look over there. To take an animal's life, you have to have a certain level of admiration for that animal. And you have to love that animal. That's why we hunt the most loved animal of all, house cats. It was like a, it was a calico. Yeah. Do your cat call. Kitty, 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 kitty. Kitty. Did you hear that? Somebody's here. Cat hunting, or hunting as we call it, it's uh, trickier than most people think. I mean, most cats we come across are protected by a family of humans that are equipped with phones that can call the police, so. How was school today? Oh, good. Good? Yeah. What did you learn? Nothing. Hmm? What did you learn? I made shapes. That's good. You put it up on the refrigerator? Okay. That would be good. Be nice. I'm hungry, Mommy. Hmm? I'm hungry. You want to help Mommy with the sandwiches? No? You want to help Mommy with sandwiches? No? OK. Maybe tomorrow, then. Welcome to my study. Let's take a look around. See, each one of these guys comes with their very own story. This right here is a tabby from over in Oak Ridge, which is real nice gated community, real nice. This guy, this guy right here, he gave me something to remember him with. See, right here. I ain't ever forgetting him. <laughs> Ouch. Oh. Uh, you got to love the chase. You have to love the chase, because uh, there are going to be some days when you go home empty-handed. I mean, a lot of the time, we're just crawling around suburban homes all day, maybe to find one or two of them tops. <laughs> but then, on the other hand, there are some days when you luck out and stumble onto a cat lady's apartment. Gotta love it. Throw the cunt. 